Uh, obviously, a, a heck of an effort by our guys. Uh, that uh, you know, similar to, to Pittsburgh, it was a tale of two halves, especially defensively. Uh, but, but it's the NFL. We found a way to, to make enough plays uh, at the end to win it. And just to me, it speaks to the character of the men in the room, uh, the resiliency, the poise, the focus. Uh, that I think a lot of teams would have shut it down, given what we faced uh, at halftime. Uh, but I, I did tell them after the game they got to stop doing it. <laughs> I said I, I you could have an EKG scheduled for tomorrow. I don't know if my heart heart can take many more of these, but uh, it, it's a heck of a win for us, like I said, uh, and, and we're we're hopeful that'll it'll provide us with a boost uh, coming back home uh, against against the Steelers. Believe in the scheme. Believe in what we're doing. Uh, get the guys in the right position, and then then it's a two-way street. They got they got to make plays, and it's and they responded. I, I thought the players handled themselves. What, uh, it was similar to the Pittsburgh locker room, uh, and and to me that that obviously that going through that experience I think helped us because it's it's like hey we started our comeback. We actually did it before the second half even started. I think that late score in the first half was was tremendous for us to get that momentum going in at halftime. Uh, and even though we ended up, I think we just kicked a field goal the first drive of the second half. Those 10 points, I think, really, really set us up, got the belief back. Uh, and, and the guys on defense, like I said, there was no major, major uh, changes to the call sheet. Uh, we, we just went out and executed better. And, it, and punt block's huge. I mean, that really eliminated uh, like three guys on the headset said it at the same time. Like, oh, there goes your two point conversion. Because we were thinking, okay, when are we going to go for two? We probably would have kicked the first one, got it to within eight, gone for two second. And then as soon as we got it, that uh, that really changed our thinking, obviously, for the for the rest of the way. But that, it's, to me, anytime you make a play like that on teams, I mean, that's very deflating when it happens to you. And it was such a such a surge of energy on our sideline. Yeah, I think that was important that uh, for Ben to come back, and that was good for for his confidence. I mean, he he uh, he did a real nice job you know, pressing the running lanes in the zone scheme and getting his shoulders squared up. And and uh, and then I thought our backs did a good job of of uh, protecting the football. I mean, this was a team that hit hard. They tackled low. I mean, they attacked the football, and I thought our guys did a good job finishing runs. How about Benjamin confidence-wise? You pulled him at the punt return after the fumble and two punt catches. We did, and, and I grabbed him when he, when he came off after the, uh, after the fumbled punt and uh, just said to him, hey, hang in there. You know, your job, you got a chance to make a play, make a play. And it's, uh, it's obvious that he lacks confidence in the, uh, in the punt return game, but for, for a guy to – I mean, that just to me is a, is a microcosm of the team. Here's a guy that had something bad happen to him, and he didn't go in the tank. Here, here he bounced back and, and made uh, two plays, including the game winner. Mike, uh, Brian Hoyer talked last week about weathering the storm on the road and how important that is. What can you say about how the, the way he held it together? He did, and I, I think his poise, I, I think, was, was pivotal for us. I just think that calming influence in the huddle, that he was, he was never out of sorts. When the guys came off on the sideline, they knew what the adjustments were. When they missed a play, they, you know, the, guy, the guys never turned on each other. The O never turned on the D. And, and that's what being a team is about. And for us to have that type of leader, that quality of leader on offense is, is one of the reasons we are where we are.